I was originally not going to go into this, but I, I remembered that I had a video about uh, that I'll post in the description about this lady named Shelly McAB, who's on YouTube. And she had this whole rant about how Obama was, you know, when he was reelected, and she was basically saying, you know, you know, saying, you know, fuck all you, you know, fuck all you liberal pussies, and, you know, talking about how. You know, now we're under a socialist state and all this crap and stuff like that. And she said, and then she snaps halfway through the <laughs> halfway through the video, and then starts taking her her anger out on her fellow right wingers, um, which I just thought was hilarious. <laughs> it was a like a twenty minute, thirty minute video, and she just, and you know, she was also obviously she was drinking. She showed that she was drinking you know, in the video and smoking, and only, the only real visual you got was when she turned her camera towards, you know, her work area, her little, her, towards her computer, and which was keeping track of the election that was obviously showing her, her wonderful alcohol collection, but all that she was doing was basically bitching and never bothered to once show her face. I managed to contact her through Twitter, and I obviously, you know, criticized her. I had criticism of, you know, her videos, obviously, because I'm a leftist. And then some of her, her little fanboy, fangirl, whatever it was, came after me and started, you know, and started basically asking me questions. And it's just like, you know, and I honestly answered them. I you know I just kind of thought it was really funny that not only does she not want to show her face on video she also doesn't bother to even address me directly so I'm kind of it's just one of those things that kind of is like if you're so hardcore against you know all these people and you have all this you know and, and you're so brave and courageous for you know, stand, to standing up the socialist left. Well, then why the hell don't you be a be a real person and actually show your face and talk to me directly? And you call everybody else, including your own fellow conservatives, pussies because they're not following in your own cause and they're not promoting your videos. Well, you're the only, you're the pussy that's not showing her face. You're the pussy that's just sitting behind a computer screen, and, and yet, and you're you're basically bad mouthing everybody on your side because they're not promoting your cause. They're not promoting your videos. I have never once asked people to promote my videos. I have a I promote my own videos through Twitter and stuff like that, but I don't go so far out. I, you know, I don't subscribe to the AdSense or whatever it is, so the monetary thing. I I just put my videos out on Twitter and through, and occasionally through Tumblr, but whatever. I've never once asked people to promote my videos because I don't need to. I get, you know, I don't get a substantial amount of viewers, but I get enough viewers that watch my and subs and subscribers that watch my videos. And the fact, though, that you're getting pissed because they're not promoting your videos, you know, and stuff like that, and not supporting your cause, you're really just, no offense, but you're acting like a real bitch. And so, I'm just kind of, I'm, I was just really, I just found your video very entertaining because it was basically just a half hour of you just bitching and moaning and complaining. There was nothing to it. There was no substance. There was no. There was no even actual arguments going on in it. You just basically were showing how ignorant you and a lot of conservatives are. The fact that you were calling that Obama a socialist, calling this a socialist state. Obama is a fucking corporatist. He's in bed with everybody else. If anything, Obama and the Democrats are centrists. They're not even socialists. Real socialism would see him abolishing corporations and the private sector and, it, and 
transitioning us towards you know getting rid of the banks getting rid of the private sector getting rid of the class system and all that Obama is not doing that Obama is the only thing Obama is really doing is saying we're gonna get rid of the Bush tax cuts which he actually reinstated a couple of years ago anyway and so now he's gonna get rid of those and then he's gonna tax the wealthy well okay you'll tax the hell out of the wealthy but you still got that class system. He's also bailing out the banks. He's not abolishing them or privatizing them, um, or whatever the case is. And he's certainly not going to abolish corporations or do it as Teddy Roosevelt did and try and t bring them down to size. He's not even doing that. That is far from socialist, in my opinion. So, again, you really show your you don't really have any argument and I'm sorry for having to bring that to your attention but I'm here to expose the truth not sugarcoat bullshit and you ma'am really really seem like you need help I suggest AA because if you're gonna go get drunk during an election and start complaining not only about leftists, I mean that's your opinion, you can do that, but then you turn on your own people. I think it's time, I really think it's time for you to enter Alcoholics Anonymous. Is speak with other people and I'll let you in on a little something. To find this help, it's very, very near the front of the telephone book. Good luck. Hey,